Currently at the AGO, we have an exhibition of uh, Toronto artist Evan Penny entitled Refigured. It is a sculpture exhibition, a retrospective over uh, the last 10 years of Evan Penny's practice. The name of this exhibition is Evan Penny Refigured. Um, that title kind of has multiple meanings. Um, refigured can imply um, uh, figuration, uh, reconsidered. Um, it can also imply the kind of um, distortions that you see in, in the show, the, um, the, the, the kind of refiguring of, of, of the body through various kind of manipulations. Um, and it, because it's a survey show, it's about looking again at my work, so refiguring it in that sense. Um, I think probably one of the um, hallmarks of, of the work and, uh, and is not that I think it's unique to my work, but it's, it's a unique feature in my work is, is that it is figurative sculpture on the one hand, but it, it, I try and situate the sculptures, the objects, somewhere between the way we imagine ourselves and experience ourselves in real time and space, and, and on the other hand, the way we imagine ourselves in an image. And so the sculptures kind of are both object and image and sort of neither at the same time. They hover, hover between image space and, and real space. And I think that's one of the underlying kind of unique features of the work. Evan Penny is uh, unique in that very few contemporary artists do traditional figurative sculpture. More often than not, you see more abstract or conceptual work. He is really a craftsman. He uh, is a master of the material. He uses silicon, resin, fabricates the eyeballs, fabricates the eyeglasses, implants hair. These are hyper-realistic sculptures that you likely don't see very often so um, with a twist so I encourage you to come down and see them for yourselves. One of the underlying themes in the exhibition is the question of portraiture. Um, I don't consider myself a portrait artist. Some of the works are portraits of real people. Some of them approach the question of portraiture. What is a portraiture? portrait? How do we imagine portraiture? What do we expect of portraiture? So a lot of the times I'm working with imaginary characters. They're, they're, they're faces and individuals that I've, I've created either strictly from imagination or maybe they're, they're kind of loose composites. I've seen, you know, seen images or combinations of images that I'm referring to. Um, this is generally uh, because I'm interested in this relationship to photography and how we experience images in film and television and magazines and this kind of constant encounter with with images of ourselves and, and others, often others we have no idea essentially who they are but they're projecting certain histories. So this is one of the, the themes of the show. Uh, the AGO also has available this uh, very beautiful book on Evan Penny's work. There's a number of articles written by curators as well as an interview with Evan Penny. Lots of colored photos of his practice and how he makes things. So that's available at the AGO uh, gift shop.